going inside. And he turns it over. Court takes the heave from Kennard. Catches his balance and scores. To that zone and they've established a man-to-man. -man. And right now finding some benefit from it as they got a block on an attempt at a putback. And it turns into three. Nicely, Georgia Tech has got to get active defensively as well. Norton wants the paint, and he swoops it off the window. Georgia's hunt misses everything. Allen to Plumley running the floor. Now back to the perimeter. Andrew for three, got it! And again, we take a look right here. The ball moving, going inside. Good recovery by Plumley. And the extra pass, you see how it's a... Allen with the drop off. Lovely Tomahawks with two. Bull City, what up? Samil Jefferson here with my captain, Marshall Plumley. Marshall, how did you? Go, how were you guys able to get a huge win tonight on the road playing against a really good Georgia Tech team? I feel like we really came together. I'm proud of my teammates, especially in an away hostile environment. Uh, great crowd, and we really came together, and we made big plays together. Uh, so those are the plays that stand out in my mind. Looking back at tonight, were the plays we made, moving the ball, extra passes, unselfishness, and it was a fun way to play. Definitely, Marshall. I, I feel like it was tail two halves. Um, that second half, uh, the guys really came out with the energy, with a verb, with uh, an emotion. You know, especially you. You know, rebounding, blocking shots. You know, monster dunks. Uh, how were you guys able to, you know, turn the tides while the game was going on and put on an amazing second half? Uh, I, I got to give a lot of credit to Coach Capel and really lighting the fire under us at halftime. He said some inspirational stuff that made us want to fight that much harder. And there were also things said between the guys. So I remember certain guys stepping up and calling me out. And I called other guys out. And when you have people holding each other accountable like that, you're going to elevate the level of your play so much. And that's what happened in the second half. Definitely. Marshall, uh, you, you finished with 12 rebounds. Uh, Georgia Tech is known you know, for having a lot of big guys. Uh, how were you able to you know, fight, bang, and battle you know, with their guys throughout that entire game to really give us that, that rock you know, that we needed to win the game tonight? Well, they do have a formidable front line, uh, you know, four talented guys that keep coming in. And I don't think I would have been able to step up tonight or play how I did tonight without Chase Jeter. And he stepped up in a big way and gave us some great minutes. So I'm proud of his performance tonight. He's only going to keep getting better. And he brought out the best in me. Dubu pointed, there you have it. Marshall Plumley and Mill Jefferson, Will City. Man.